awesomepaintjob.com. Model Air Olive Drab is airbrushed onto the whole model. Game color Plague Brown is then sprayed at a downward 45 degree angle to highlight the top and vertical surfaces that light from above would hit. Game color Dead Flesh is sprayed directly above the miniature for the brightest highlight. Before the wash is applied, Game Color Gloss Varnish is sprayed on the entire model for two reasons. To protect the airbrush work done so far and to create a barrier for the wash cleanup with alcohol. After a couple coats of gloss varnish are allowed to completely dry, my wash recipe of baby poop is sprayed onto the entire model. Using isopropyl alcohol and a sponge makeup applicator, I remove the dried wash from the surface while trying to leave it in the deep detail areas. Game color Plague Brown is applied to the fly icon on the right shoulder pad as well as the skulls on the left shoulder pad. Reaper Master Series color Ghoul Skin is applied to all the flesh on the face. For the first highlight, Master Series Moldy Skin is applied to all but the deepest recesses. The final highlight is achieved with Master Series Paint Bloodless Skin. 
Apply this to the areas of interest that you want to bring out and think of the areas that would be hit directly by light above the model. Vallejo model air color, aluminum, was chosen for all the silver pieces. Game color Beastie Brown is thinned, four drops of water to one drop of paint, and applied to areas where I want rust. To make the chips and the armor, a one-to-one -one mix of game colors charred brown and black is used. Highlights for the chips are done with a one-to-one -one mix of game colors Plague Brown and Dead Flesh. Putting these highlights directly under the dark chip I made will help create the illusion of a 3D chip. Game color dead flesh is used to pick out some edges and the armor is done. Vallejo pigment green earth is mixed with water to a wash consistency, then applied to the base being careful not to touch the feet of the model. Game color black is applied to the base lip, and when dry, the model receives a coat of game color matte varnish. Then we're ready to game. Awesomepaintjob.com